Okay, folks, our next pattern is the bullish harami, and um, it is a two candlestick pattern. It is a bullish reversal pattern. What we look for with the harami is um, the last candle, the first candlestick in the pattern to be a continuation of the prevailing trend. Uh, and then the next candlestick is going to open above the close of the previous day and close below the open of the previous day. So it's an inside day closing within the open and close of the previous day. So your bullish candlestick is going to close again inside the previous day's um, range. Uh, the open and close anyway, not the high and the low. Um, <clears throat> Pretty high probability pattern. Um, again, especially if you find it at support, uh, you know, in a valley, if you will, okay, or a low, a swing low, um, in oversold market conditions. And we'll look for that in the next video. What one might do is use the first candlestick in the patterns high as a trigger. Excuse me as a trigger for the entry long. So we'd put a line right here on the chart, trying to make it nice and straight. Mm, there we go. Okay, this would be our trigger long right here. So as the price action continued up and closed beyond or moved beyond, depending upon your strategy, this line, this line would be our trigger line. Okay, and that's the bullish Harami.